but <clears throat> enough about the sound of silence like uh like if you do want to see like um any of the videos from the tiktok channel that i just deleted uh can't bring it back now it's too late like i already like panicked and like oh no what did i do and like uh i just it just needed to like that particular channel needs to rest like way past its like time like can always create more but if you want to see any of the of any, any most of the same videos are available on youtube.com slash at little kookaburra so i don't know what uh national like what barriers like they've set that like in different countries if you don't have youtube um in your nation well you're probably not miss missing all that much and i'm so sorry that if i let if i've disappointed any fans out there that like I really did, I do, and always will appreciate the hearts and the likes. Um, even sometimes, like, even some of the comments that are, like, hate speech. I mean, I still appreciate hate speech every now and then. Like, who doesn't love, like, being, like, mocked and, like, well, in your head, like, what, why are they saying it that way? And it's just like, well, like, they just write, like, that, like, I get offended super easily and I'm not really, like, like, meant for the life of show business. Like, I don't know about that. I don't know about all the assumptions that follow, like, what you want to hear, like, me say, but mainly due to the hate speech is the reason that I took it down. Uh, like, mainly due to, like, people assuming that, I'm um, something that I'm completely not is the second reason I take most of it down. It's the third is from like getting messages from people and like not being able to respond in any way because they don't really allow like personal messages to come through, like at least on my account. Like, I don't know why. Like, all I do is basically get like a lot of like people that look interesting to talk to but like seem like either they're, they're robot accounts or uh, not robot accounts but like bot accounts or like people trying to like uh, ask for like bunches of like money or like iTunes gift cards and like I don't have that much money to begin with. Like, like the money that I have, I gotta save now for my new, like either for a new apartment or for like a lawyer from this illegal eviction going on. Like, and I really disdain like illegal evictions. And it, there's like plenty of people that go through them and put up less of a nuisance than me. But in my opinion, like, I don't know, it's, it's wrong that, that landlords like abuse their position on like appliances that from like 1906 that are like installed in your kitchen and like give you this illusion that like, well, at least there is a God, like, like type attitude from landlords in this area is absolutely trashy and like, I don't really, it, it does me great dishonor, like, dis, like, dissing my reputation like that, and dissing my family's reputation, even, like, like, thinking that appliances have to be, like, both plugged into a wall and connected to an electrical grid at all times, and that's, like, not really safe, like, to do, it's not a safe like, ethical practice to keep 100% of switches in the on position, like, that, that is very much a dangerous attitude towards, like, leasing a piece of land to a disabled uh, resident who came here um, expecting that like he wouldn't be like verbally and mentally abused by staff members and wouldn't be verbally and mentally assaulted and then like harassed more and taken to court and like stir up like whatever like is in the past about my legal situation just bring another open blemish and have it sign your name next to it and then stand on that and laugh and god will surely take you into heaven then um so